This is Eric Mwada with Mwada.com. Let's take a look at the idea and concept of adjusting buy points, especially as far as breakouts are concerned. Now, I've touched on this on previous videos. So what we can see here is, let's say we take a closing high. We have a breakout that takes place. Prices go higher. They form a new closing high, let's say a monthly closing high in this example. And then what happens sometimes is you're going to experience a filled breakout below the initial breakout level. So this means that once the breakout fails, that is a good enough reason to get out of the name because you don't know whether it's going to drift lower or it's going to form a base that could take months weeks or years sometimes now once you see a field breakout it is good practice to now adjust your buy point so this new closing high becomes the next potential breakout level so what you do is okay so you got stopped out and now you're out of the position but you don't have to necessarily give up on the name some instrument sticks take several attempts before they finally get it together so the future breakout level the new breakout level is the higher new closing high now of course if you're using weekly charts it's the recent weekly closing high if you're using daily charts we can say the recent daily closing high and of course we repeat the process if the minimum requirements are met then the next breakout level should be good enough to take a fresh interest and have some representation with a new purchase and see how things go sometimes it might be yet another field breakout but in this example let's see how we had a breakout here which we captured in terms of a breakout alert for paid subscribers now you'll see what happened here is we would go on to fail that breakout failed because on the following month there was no follow through actually we had a close below the prior monthly closing high that's a failed breakout reason to get out and what we should have done is we should have set a new breakout alert which is the August monthly closing high and see whether we can use that monthly closing high from August as the next buy point now this was always the plan but something out of our expectations took place today because as I was setting to send a breakout alert for paid subscribers this stock just could not stop during today's action so unfortunately these things happen sometimes they don't wait for you this is the monthly take a look at the daily you can see for most of the day this stock has just been steadily grinding higher at some point was up almost 70 percent for today's gain alone but the idea is still concrete the idea can still be good enough to help you capture any future breakout potential unfortunately for us today's breakout did not give us a chance to be part of this nice move that the stock has experienced but again it goes to show that adjusting for a new higher breakout is the way to go if you experience a failed breakout and even though failed breakouts can be frustrating but the truth is it's just part of the breakout game and this instrument this this stock has been mentioned a couple of times for paid subscribers as you can see in august august twice in august three times in august in june and the earliest breakout was in the middle of may when it broke out with the minimum requirement which is the breakout based on either this monthly closing high or this one so that's the breakout I'm talking about, the initial breakout in May here. And if we take, we can see that around May and going forward, the stock has met the minimum requirements. As we can see, RSI was moving to three-year highs. MACDs were also moving to minimum three-year highs. In this case, they were moving to all-time highs. 
because the stock is an IPO from 2018. And of course, these are the minimum requirements of the Ultimate Moade Breakout. Links for this are going to be in the description of this video. So yes, with today's spectacular move, we missed the entry around here. And the stock did not wait for us. But sometimes these things happen. The point of this video is we need to be adjusting or it's good practice to be adjusting for future potential breakouts by moving to the next highest new closing high as your next entry point. Eric Moore Mother.com Love Light, Light Love, Namaste.